Oh, shit. Okay. All right. Well, Tom, you start because you, um, you went first last time. Okay. So for my two locks, I feel like I know he's been injured of recent, but he's going to come with the form within the uh, in the warm up test matches. Uh, James Ryan. And uh, my other one's going to be Ian Henderson. Is my oh, other lock. Oh, fuck. Are you messing? You got two Irish in the second round. I've, I've had right. Tom, Tom, I put had, on your I blue and Marrow. green glasses. I, I, you gotta put I on have... your. Hey, you gotta get your green glasses. Get your green glasses. Hold on. I'll do you one better. So. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, that went down the wrong way. So, um, <laughs> Tom's joking. Hold on, Tom. I would have had. I would have had Marrow. I told you in there, but he just. Yeah, I think he is away way too many penalties, and Andre Pollard can kick him from his own twenty-two. So I feel like he's just going to screw us up in a single bit. That's why I picked Ian Henderson over him, and Ian Henderson is one of the most physically, like one of the stronger runners in of the second rows. I thought to pick up, um, so that's why I, I picked both of them. I and agree I with you. Was, Go. Sorry, yeah, I agree with you that Henderson actually is if you like of that Six Nations, he had a much better tournament than, than James Ryan. Um I haven't picked either of those people, Tom. Me neither. Uh, I've gone for Mara Toji because he's world class and is probably one of the best rugby players um of his generation. And then my second pick and my Lions captain is Big Alan Wynn because it's fucking big Alan Wynn. Legend of the game. He's the person Gats is gonna pick. I think um, I think if it's not Alan Wynn, it'll be a Toji, but uh, for captaincy. Um, but you know, I brought this up on the pod episode or whatever. People are complaining about how old he is, but he's putting in shifts. Like I mean, I think what's so, so he's had he had seventy five tackles over the championship. Hamish Watson, people were talking about him. He had fifty five, so seventy five tackles in the championship for a lad like you know, one hundred fifty seven Test matches under his belt, and he's put in that kind of work, you know, day in, day out. Alan Wynn is, is incredible. And um, I absolutely love watching him play. It's one of the reasons are, I like watching ready, Wales. Are you ready for this, Jack? Right. Go on. Ladies What'd and gentlemen, have? this is a first, not just for the podcast, but in history. I'm going to agree with Jack Kiernan. And I've gone Maro Atoje and Alan Wynn Jones. And I'll tell you why, right? Oh, my God. Because I was, I was leaning towards James Ryan because I think he's so, so good at stealing lineouts and he's just being a bastard around the pitch. But I thought Atoje does pretty much that same job, right? And if, you're, if I was a South African forward, who would I want to play against the least? And for me, that is Atoje. I think he's the biggest nuisance and the biggest disruptor. I wanted to pick Ty Byrne at five, but I thought... Lion stores, you have to have that senior head, that senior figure captain in the side, and he's got to be starting. And so I picked Alan Wynn because I couldn't see an Atoje or a Farrell or, you know, a Conor Murray. I couldn't see someone like that captain. And I know Warburton didn't play all the games, even though he was captain last tour. But for me, when you're in this situation now where you've got Alan Wynn, who's still playing great rugby and is still obviously the, the, the sort of the leader that the Lions needs, he's got to play. And so... Atoje and Alan Wynn. I agree with Jack. I never Charlie, look at, that. <laughs> look at us. Look at us. Look at us. Serious. Like that. This is serious to Who would have thought? Well, it's a me. better pick than Tom's. Fuck <laughs> sake. Even I think Ian Henderson's a bad one. Uh oh. Well, now hit us with the stats. Who's the tallest two guys you picked? <laughs> I picked James Ryan and Maro Atoje. Well, they, I, that, that was my original pick. That I, was my I original picked pick. James Ryan and Maro Atoje because it's playing to my game plan since that I'm not picking Gatlin's squad I'm picking my own which is not apparently what we were doing today <laughs> and he's all right he's, he won't share his uh, cocoa butter with me but that's okay um he's, <laughs> I just got to watch him lather himself up a bit but I'm rooming with him <laughs> rooming with him at the minute so um I'm yeah make sure I'm, he's liking all the music and he's tucked in at night but uh, other than that sort of stuff no it's, it's been nice to work with him um 